the real reason why Netflix is losing money. To stream videos online, Netflix was by far the most popular option. During the 2020 first quarter coronavirus pandemic, Netflix saw an increase of 15.8 million new subscribers and an increase in total viewership to an all-time high. However, once lockdowns were lifted, subscriber numbers plummeted, which led to a significant sell-off of company shares. Is Netflix losing money? We will discuss the reason in today's video. Netflix loses roughly 1 million users for the first time in a decade, Netflix has experienced a decline in membership. Is this the final nail in the coffin for the most popular streaming service on the planet? For the second quarter of 2022, Netflix reported a decrease in members with nearly 1 million users canceling their accounts. Given the company's decisions, the fall in subscribers during the second quarter of 2022 is hardly surprising. Netflix has terminated its operations in Russia. Since the conflict in Ukraine broke out, Netflix has joined the ranks of hundreds of other firms worldwide that have ceased operations in Russia. The cooperation acknowledged losing some 700,000 subscribers due to its decision to cease operations in Russia. Then, ever since the conflict in Ukraine broke out, we have witnessed the significant influence that the conflict in Ukraine has had on pricing. It is simple to understand why some individuals would cancel their Netflix memberships to pay for food, housing, and various other bills in light of the slow economy. Netflix increases prices in the United States and Canada Netflix raised its subscription prices in the U.S. and Canada in 2022. When customers saw the higher prices, many stopped paying for Netflix altogether. Netflix reports that due to the price increase implemented in January 2022, 600,000 North American users abandoned their accounts. Growth of Netflix impeded by account sharing Netflix account sharing has been one of the service's biggest challenges. Although Netflix's terms of service expressly forbid the sharing of account information, many customers routinely do just that. According to Netflix's estimations, there are 100 million unpaid subscribers worldwide, including 30 million in the United States and Canada alone. With over 220.67 million customers, Netflix's goal of attracting another 100 million would be a major achievement. Netflix continues to suffer from content depletion from media companies. Many popular shows and movies from U.S. television networks have been removed from Netflix. Television programs from major networks such as NBC, CBS, AMC, and others are on competing streaming services. Companies like HBO Max and Discovery Plus have been combining, developing their streaming services, and encouraging users to watch their content on those platforms rather than on Netflix. As a result, Netflix has committed enormous resources to develop its original programming. People would rather watch their old favorites on vintage TV shows than Netflix's original material, which is fine. but. Not great. If you're enjoying this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet to show your support. Standard of Produced Material Netflix has been producing more and more original programming, but the quality of these shows has been inconsistent. Many of the shows and movies aren't very good, but there are some standouts like Stranger Things, whose fourth season premiered to 1.3 billion hours of viewing in the first four weeks. The firm prioritizes output over quality in the hopes that some of its products will sell well. Viewers are unhappy with the content, and if nothing changes, they will continue to cancel their subscriptions. Discontent with Netflix is widespread since the streaming service routinely pulls the plug on loved series after just one season. Insufficient space exists for all the streaming options There are currently an excessive number of streaming options to choose from. Not only do we have Netflix, Hulu, HBO Max, and Amazon Prime Video, but we also have Peacock, Paramount+, Plus, Disney+, Plus, Apple TV+, Plus, ESPN+, Plus, etc. It all boils down to which series and movies people would rather pay to see, as each platform presents a unique collection. Netflix Strategy to Reverse Subscriber Declines Netflix's growth has leveled out, so the firm needs to do more to ensure it remains at the forefront of the streaming industry. Future efforts will be needed to increase subscriptions and maintain current revenue levels. Netflix has decided to address the issue of account sharing immediately. Netflix has already begun warning users about the dangers of sharing passwords and has conducted an experiment where members in select countries were asked to pay more to be permitted to share accounts voluntarily. In some Latin American countries, Netflix has also introduced an add a home function that requires users to pay an additional price of roughly $3 to share their subscription with other homes. Therefore, it is reasonable to expect safeguards against the practice of exchanging passwords to be put in place sooner rather than later. Netflix has also acknowledged thinking about introducing an ad-supported plan. Hulu, Peacock, and Paramount Plus are just a few streaming platforms that provide such a package.
Considering the number of people who decided to cancel their Netflix subscription after the most recent price increase, offering a cheaper plan could be a viable alternative. Although unfortunately, Netflix is experiencing subscriber attrition after so much success over the past decade. We recognize that external factors have contributed to this decline. However, ultimately, it is up to us as consumers to determine which services we wish to pay for and which we wish to forego. With the proliferation of competing services, Netflix needs to stay at the top of its game to maintain its subscriber base. Well, that's all for today's video. Tell us in the comment section how this one was. I hope that you found this video interesting. If you want to see more videos like this, please consider subscribing for more. And don't forget to give comments and provide us with your valuable feedback. We'll see you in the next video with some more interesting facts and stories. And until then, stay tuned.